Sonny Anderson, co-host of The Kitchen and inventor of the popular inflatable snack stadium, The Infladium. She's a self-proclaimed football fanatic, and she's showing us how to put together a game day watch party that promises to be winning, even if your team isn't. <laughs> oh, is that a dig? The Giants don't win that much, do they? Hey, 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 hey. Hey. <laughs> so, I, was, I was there when they won the Super Bowl. It was fabulous, it was right? Big. That's a big deal because yeah, they were we'll playing the Patriots. Again one day. And I, the Patriots were undefeated. Yeah, we murdered them. Yeah, y'all did. Yeah, it was a good season. So um, there's a lot of things that you do when you lose, and a lot of it is uh, tied up in eating your sorrow. You eat your, uh -huh. eat your feelings. Yes. Yeah, so, so whether your team is losing or winning, I got some food for you. Yeah. You guys we'll ready? Today, yeah. yeah, we're going to make it today. So remember I just told you about my food truck caddy? Yes. Well, yep. On the side of it is actually a menu, and one of the menu items are past the pretzel bites. Uh -huh. And so I'm going to pass the pretzel bites, and we're going to show you some cool dips. Awesome. Um, so how many people make pretzels? Like zero, right? None. It's no. so simple. It's as easy as pizza dough. Oh. Okay. I did it once with a bunch of Amish people when I was Yeah, younger. really? Yeah. yeah, it's super crafty if you want to make the, oh. the, the, the oh, dough yourself. Oh. But I love a store-bought shortcut. You can usually get a ball of pizza dough in the freezer section. Yeah. So just put it in a bowl with a little bit of olive oil so it doesn't stick and get cracky. And it's going to expand and get room temperature um, over the course of a few hours on the countertop, right? Cool. Uh -huh. So once that's done... You're going to get some flour and just kind of get it onto your flat surface and roll out the pizza dough to a rectangle. Okay. Uh -huh. You know, you're looking for about a quarter of an inch thick. Do you have and to worry then, about air bubbles like this? No, not problem? at all. No, I love okay. an air bubble. An air bubble, like when you make a pizza, the air yeah. bubble is the oh, best yeah. part. You know what I'm saying? That cavern of love. Yes. <laughs> so just come through and make about two inch strips. That's about an inch and some change, yes. which doesn't really matter. Okay. Great. And then you go along perpendicularly and you're going to do the same. Uh -huh. And each of these is going to turn into a pretzel bite. Now you're like, it's just pizza. How does that work? So you're going to ball these up, make little okay. balls. They don't have to be beautiful or perfect. Right. They're a little bit smaller because I made mine smaller than the ones that we set up before. That's okay. All right. So obviously you're a big Giants fan. Do I you, am. Do you ever miss a game? I don't miss a game. Whether at home or away, I'm either in the stands or on the couch. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? And the inflate, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, there I go, chilling. Yeah. yeah okay. I find tailgating is the best part of the football game. We used to just go to the tailgates and then go home. Exactly. Yeah. Plus, I mean, who wants to buy the drinks inside? You know what I'm saying? Know, Way too expensive. All right, so baking this soda? is baking soda. That's awesome. going to turn our pizza balls into pretzel bites. Okay. Awesome. That's boiling water, and the, you just drop them in. Oh, wow. Just drop cool. them in. So they're going to boil. A lot of people know when you make bagels, this is one of the steps. You're going to boil them mm -hmm. first and then bake them. Okay. And so they're going to start floating. They'll puff up, change color a little bit. And when they do, you're going to pull them out of the water and put them on a nonstick uh, aluminum foil or parchment works. Yeah. Cool. So that's an egg wash. Right. Okay. It's just egg and water. That's going to give us that rich brown color oh, yeah. uh, that pretzels adore. You can put it all over or just over the top. Uh-huh. And you brought pictures I did. of your fans using the Infladium. Yes. Y'all check these out. Look at how they fill oh, it up. Oh. Fun. Isn't it? They just threw the condiments in the middle, those exactly. people. Exactly. <laughs> I love it, though. I jar. love it. Look at that. What is that? Yeah, those are like cookies, like cupcakes. You can do dessert and dinner as well. Exactly. Well, right. that's the thing about it. It not only holds food, it also holds three cases of drinks with ice. Oh, nice. so, yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah, you got to look. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Can we? I'm going to watch the game. Can we oh. triangulate who that was in the audience? I, know, I heard it from that area right there. Yeah. And you got a recipe book as well, right? I have a recipe that, book that comes with it. The first um, one had uh, lots of recipes, and this one I thought I'd pare it down to something easy for game day. Cool. Uh -huh. So they're all under five ingredients. Oh, nice. So I've got things like chili, pulled pork, yeah, man. dips, all under five That's ingredients. Nice. And it comes inside there. I mean, you get nice. the infladium, oh, yeah. you get the cookbook. Yeah, it's my Sonny's game day recipes and party tips. Perpetually just, eating a chip, right? Always there. eating. Always, always eating. eating, eating nice always eating. Chip. Are you, I mean, obviously you'll be celebrating the Super Bowl. Are you going to have yes. a party? Yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna either go. Um, uh -huh. It depends on how expensive it is. You know? Or cold. I know. It, <laughs> it is really is cheap. Expensive. Yeah, it's in Atlanta this year. Uh. Yeah. And it does get cold in Georgia. So I'll either go or I'll like tailgate and do like you said, then go uh -huh. right back to right. the hotel. Right. Yeah. Yeah, so. So then you're going to boil these for a second, right. put them over here. Put them over here. You put some egg wash on it, and then this is pretzel salt. Sprinkle it on to taste. The oven is at 425 degrees. It's going to take about 15 to 20 minutes. And awesome. where are they? 
Oh. If only we they're, had pretzels. They're oh, inside oh, the Titanium. Oh, they're they're here. Here. They're here. They're here. They're here. They're here. They're here. So oh, look, they look like little pretzels. Yes, go ahead. Beautiful. Dip in. So we've got all the different tips. Which sauce tips. do you like the best for pretzels? Mm. Um, I love a hey, honey mustard, good. obviously. Yeah. That's the first place you start. So mm. all of these sauces, the recipes, are available in the book that comes with the Infladium, mm. all under five ingredients. Some guac, some salsas, awesome. barbecue and mayonnaise. A lot Ooh. of people, that's what you dipped into right there. That's barbecue and mayonnaise. Do you have another invention in mind that you're thinking of doing? I, I do, actually. Um, and so the process is research and then convincing someone that it's a good idea for them to help me create. Because I'm just the person that does the sketching and everything. I don't have the engineering degree. Right. Um, so yes, I do, and so hopefully. you come up with the ideas. You're very creative. Right. You. I just, very busy. Thank you. Yes. I'm, I'm really pleased and happy. Um, I never really, you know, you don't plan life. It just happens, yeah. and so like this is exciting and fun. And um, I like the idea when I see people online using it and they love it and it makes them look like yeah. rock stars at their party. That's yeah. all I wanted to do. And we will, yeah. you know what I mean? And we will help you yeah. by That's eating right. the food <laughs> within. Well, you bring us.